guys you know i'm here again with another video yes so today guys i'll be doing a seafood boil and as you can see here in front of me i have corns i have potato i have the purple potato and i have the original irish potato i have corns in here and i have smoked pork sausage and you're gonna allow these to cook for 15 minutes you know you don't want to overcook your potato because after we're gonna put them in the oven so you're gonna allow this to cook for 10 to 15 minutes and we'll be back we're okay check on guys our sauce. so these are my ingredients for the butter sauce okay so first you're gonna need um i melt four cups of butter this is four cups of melted butter i'm not really a spicy person because normally the seafood boil are always spicy but i'm not so i cut down on the spice actually so this is like you know, a half cup or a quarter cup of hot sauce so you can use whatever hot sauce you like over here i have lime juice freshly squeezed lime um not lime lemon sorry um so the lemon adds freshness to the shrimp and over here i have half half of an onion i dice half of an onion and over here i have um well i think this is around five cloves of diced garlic yes and in here i have onion powder or origamo i have fish seasoning black pepper i have the old bay seasoning and i have garlic powder now guys these and you can add like your all-purpose maggie all-purpose season whatever you have you can add that to it as well whichever you choose so these are mine this is the old bay the onion powder and the cayenne pepper i will not be using this because this is mad hot and this is the origamo and the garlic powder Yes, guys, so these are my ingredients for the sauce. Now we're going to mix and combine everything. Okay, guys, so after I have combined everything, I've mixed everything together. This is our sauce. Look at that thickness. Oh, my God, so nice. Okay, guys, now in the pan, I add a little sauce, and I add the onion and the garlic. You now we're gonna just do this, you know, mix it around till it's cooking soft. And then we're gonna add the rest of the sauce to get that garlic, you know, that nice taste. Oh my God, I can already taste it already. So we're gonna just allow this to go for like two or three minutes until they're soft. Yeah, you know, guys, so I add the sauce. You're gonna just let this boil for like two minutes, you know, give it a good stir and just leave it for two minutes. Yes, guys, these are the shrimp that I'll be using. You guys can use whatever shrimp you want, whatever shrimp of your choice, you know. I bought this one, the packet shrimp. It's already de-veined and all of that. So I'll be using this shrimp in the boil. And remember, guys, you don't boil the shrimp with the potato and all that. The shrimp will be cooked when the sauce and everything goes on, when it goes into the oven. Yes, guys, so we came back to the pot. And this is what your potato... Yeah, this is how soft your potato should be, you know, not to overcook it. You know, this is how it should be perfect. Okay, guys, now I'll be adding my shrimp. Adding my shrimp. Mixing that all in. Good, good, good. Now I'll be adding my corns. Adding all of that goodness. My potatoes. You know, added in everything. Okay, guys, so after you add your stuff, you're gonna cover it with the sauce. All nice, cover it all nice. Now we're gonna transfer this to a pan, fall paper red, and bake it so after i'm gonna show you all that okay my guys so after i transferred it to this pan and everything i add a little excess sauce on top now i'm gonna just sprinkle like my leftover seasoning because i didn't use all the seasoning sprinkle some of that on top sprinkle some of that on top the rest of the seasoning and then we're gonna put some parsley on top Okay, guys, so I put some parsley on top 
and we're gonna just fall paper this and put it in the oven for like 20 to 30 minutes. Then we'll see the result. This is the result of my seafood boil. Mm -hmm. Look at that.